Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels, or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Um, today um, we're having the door uh, mended um, on our house, um, so that's taken a long while. And if you hear any banging, then that uh, banging about, then that's what it is uh, during the video. Um, uh, today uh, the weather is cloudy in England. Um, in the Midlands, um, again still uh, quite cold um, and uh, today I'm going to be doing Travel News UK 5 Exciting Facts January 2022 Part 2 so I'm going to fire away with the first fact which is Sky News uh, Covid pre-departure tests and travel isolation scrapped in England Airline UK and Manchester Airport Group say current restrictions um, could come at a huge cost to the travel industry and are holding back its recovery uh, the Prime Minister announced the end of pre-Covid uh, tests which is really good news for the travel industry and obviously people in general um especially that want to travel abo abroad for whatever reason and um number two uh politico europe france loosens uh, uk travel restrictions france last thursday expanded the list of um compelling reasons uh, to travel to and from uh, the uk affect of January uh, the 6th um, the French co uh, consulate um, this year so that's really good news uh, to get tourism in the UK bumped up and number three uh, Sky News uh, COVID-19 top holiday destinations revealed um, as easing of UK travel restrictions spark, sparks a booking surge. So top destinations such as Spain and Greece um, um, are easing, their, you, easing of UK travel restrictions. There's more bookings. Um, on uh, travel websites um, and at um, tour operator set centres or travel agencies etc. Sky News takes a look at travel advice and Covid situations for this year, most popular foreign destinations um, which is really good news uh, so you can read that on Sky News for more information and uh, number four uh, Business Travel News Europe Ethero warns 2022 will be a challenge um, challenging year for uh, UK travel the UK's uh, hub airport said COVID-19 continues to pose a significant challenge to travel industry with Heathrow only catering for 19.0 million passengers in 2021, less than 25% of uh, 2019 and also down from uh, 2020 figures. Um, again, because a lot of people are travelling uh, are looking to uh, do day trips or um, have holidays in the UK obviously because it's a lot more uh, safer um, and just don't want to take the risk um, of having to change or uh, cancel the holiday and go through the rigorous process also of getting travel refunds and uh, last but not least the guardian heathrow uh, demands end to 
COVID testing for vaccination the vaccinated as 600,000 cancelled flights I can understand um, but obviously if uh, the government thinks it's that important uh, to again test people and and so again they've got to obviously keep the general public safe um obviously rather than obviously consider the travel industry but i do think that they should help the travel industry out with um grants and um, etc do more to help the travel industry in my opinion so I would like to say thank you for watching and um, I'll see you tomorrow for a lifestyle channel video uh, only at uh, chest uh, products um, and giving reviews, my honest reviews um, tomorrow. So I would like to say I hope you everybody has um, a good day and night and don't forget if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel and thank you and have a good day and night thank you bye